Hey guys, Prime here, and welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil Zero. So, where we last left off, we crashed the train, managed to hit the emergency brakes just in time to where we didn't crash into this building going full speed, which really would have been unfortunate. That would have been an easy way to get a makeover. Uh, and now we're trying to find a way out of here. I don't like these places with running water. I'm always afraid something's going to pop out, and it really reminds me of the worm seen in Resident Evil 3. And as you guys know, I'm not very fond of that worm. It caused me much pain and suffering. And I'm hoping there's a save room up here. Hoping, hoping, wishing. The Umbrella Research Center? <gasps> the first general manager, Dr. James Marcus. Who on earth are those people? She's just a rookie, a member of STARS. Hmm. What about the mail? I'm unfamiliar with Attention! Mm -hmm. This is Dr. Marcus. Please be silent as we reflect upon our company motto. Obedience breeds discipline. Discipline breeds unity. Unity breeds power. Power is life. <laughs> who are you? It was I who scattered the T-virus in the mansion. Needless to say, I contaminated the train, too. What? Revenge on Umbrella. <laughs> Ten years ago, Dr. Marcus was murdered by Umbrella. You helped them, didn't you? <laughs> wow. Well, needless to say, that's the one guy that caused the destruction of Raccoon City, basically. Since he released the T-Virus. <sighs> that bastard. Anyway really need to find a save room sometime soon and I think I need to help Bill oh wait, the typewriter right there need to go ahead and give Billy some uh, some sweet sweet loving he got chomped on out there where's this at typewriter over here over here typewriter there we go. Let's go ahead and save. Alright, let's do a little bit of inventory management real quick. Because I think Rebecca has... Yep, she's full on just crap. Oh, you know what? We could probably combine those. There we go. Uh, freeze up some space. Um, huh. Go ahead and give Billy that. Okay. Alright, so we are going to go ahead and pick up this ammo, give this to Rebecca. The way I'm doing on my ammo conservation, I don't think I'm going to be wanting to kill too many things in the near future. I pretty much have no ammo. But if you guys have been following me for a while, then you know that that's pretty much me every single Resident Evil game. Okay. 
Alright, let's figure out where we are at, shall we? <clears throat> nice. Very creepy. I'll go check over there. Okay. I'm waiting for a dog to jump out of the windows. Whoa, something just happened. Don't know what that was. I'm not going back out there. Hmm, bathroom stalls, never good. Rebecca, where are you? Oh shit. No! Oh, he's getting his ass kicked. Run, Rebecca, run! I forgot you have to actually take care of your partners. What's out here? Oh, shit. What the fuck is that? I don't even know what that... Is that one of those leech things? He follows me. Okay, he followed me. <sighs> Stupid AI. I don't want any more mallet of cocktails, alright? Oh! Wow. I just answered my own question on what would kill that. <laughs> Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, run by it. Come on, come on, come on, Billy. This isn't time to fuck around. It's time to run. Oh, jeez. I guess it just regenerates. Ah, oh, how annoying. And I've totally screwed myself out of ammo, man. I'm glad I didn't play this one hard, that's all I gotta say. Uh, I think I have enough inventory space at this point. Okay. Let's rock, baby, come on. Let's go. I want to see you withstand these searing temperatures. What? Really? Now it's gone. That's... That's great! I... Fucker. Maybe he's in here. I want my revenge. Oh, come on! Get off! Come on. Are you kidding me? Oh, thank God. Wow, it takes three of them. Jesus Christ, man. Alright, well, I'm gonna have to play it safe, that's for sure. Oh my god. I am so fucked. Uh, this might be a short run, guys, because I might just die. 
and be beyond redemption? I really don't know. It's looking pretty grim. Maybe I'll like walk into an armory or something, if I'm lucky. All right. All that for a locked door. Image of a clock, okay. I guess we're back to collecting keys with things on them. Or something with a thing on it, because it's not a key, because there's no keyhole. Okay. Mm we got, we got anything? Oh, well that's where we came from. And that's the front door that is currently barred. I don't think they want us to leave. It's the only other way we can go. Wait, can we go upstairs? I don't usually like going upstairs. Not first, anyway. I always feel like, for some reason, that the harder enemies should be up top. I don't know why. Maybe it's just like old school video game logic. Oh, fuck, man. Come on. Come, Billy, come on. God, thank God they're slow, at least. Alright, so we get some ammo. Pick up the ammo. Thank you, Rebecca. I don't want to run right into a zombie's, like, cold embrace or anything. I'm trying to be careful. This guy, what does he have? Do you have anything on you, dude? Okay. No? He's gonna get up, isn't he? Fuck. It seems like there should be something I could get from him, though. Nah, fuck it. I don't have time, man! Thank God they're not fast zombies. Oh, dimly lit area. I don't like you. Window. I don't like you either. I'm actually kind of scared. Not like scared in the ooh, but kind of like worried, I guess would be the better word to use right now. I'm a little worried that I'm going to die any minute now. See that, but I kind of want to ignore it. Oh, there's another shotgun. Oh, thank the. Oh, it's an actual shotgun. It's not a hunting rifle. Thank the heavens. Oh, thank you. Okay. Oh, poor Billy has nothing, man. Let's regroup. Roger. What is that? Black statue. Okay. Ah, uh, hope I don't regret this. Cut, climb the ladder. Okay. Very strange, but okay. Don't know why that happened, guys. <laughs> I knew it. Oh, no. Come, no! 
Billy! Really? You fucking... Alright, and I'm back. So, I had to redo that entire part. Um, but this time, I actually knew it was kind of going to go on, so I didn't waste every single freaking bit of ammo I had. helping. <laughs> Go on. Phew. Wait, you're not even dead yet, are you? Oh. No, he's dead. Awesome. More herbs. Tons of stuff to heal with. Uh, nothing to kill anything with. Isn't that great? Billy's empty, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab these herbs and combine, <clears throat> or at least um, give them to Rebecca to combine. So, cause he can't actually combine them at all. Ay ay ay. gun back though. Thank you, Billy. Yeah, you can keep all that. Sure, why not? I probably should equip that, shouldn't I? Mm, that would make too much sense, though. <sighs> so far, this game is very intense. And Oh, door's now unlocked. Okay. I thought I went all the way for a dead end. I was about to be upset. Okay, someone really doesn't want us to leave this place. Oh, note time! What do we got, what do we got? Regulations for trainees. Training facility mission. This training facility will raise a new generation of model employees to serve the future of Umbrella Corps. Applying the strictest and most rigorous training standards, this facility will, without regard for gender, race, or creed, produce only the best candidates to be the global future leaders of Umbrella Corporation. We look forward to the development of your leadership qualities. Training facility guidelines. Discipline, obedience, unity. These three words are the basic principles which govern Umbrella Corporation employees and are to be considered the law of this facility. Keep these words in mind at all times. Devote yourselves to your training and bring honor to yourselves and the corporation. James Marcus, Director, Umbrella Corporation Management Training Facility. Okay, so that was just a little bit of fluff. Nothing terribly important in that. Something behind this podium? Huh? Huh? Something up here? Yeah. What do we got? What do we got? Evac drill path. Oh look, system disk. Umbrella and their freaking system disks. Which are all on like floppy drives, and it would appear. And we got some ammo over here, I can definitely see that from afar. Oh yeah, give me that shotgun ammo. I have a feeling something really bad's about to happen though. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let him pick these up. I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick too. I, uh, don't really trust what's going to happen next. Okay. Let's go ahead and see what is going on. There's got to be something around here. Some clue. Well, hello, Mr. Zombie. I have no ammo, so I am useless. Uh, I don't want to waste.
waste any ammo. Let's see what else is out here. I remember watching a walkthrough with Necroscope, and I think there's a boss fight coming up. See, that's the way we came, though, so this has to be the way. Unless there's another door over here. Oh, there's the other door. This might be where the boss fight's at. No, it is not where the boss fight's at. Crap. Get out of my way, Rebecca. I have no idea what it's gonna do. Absolutely nothing! That's always good. It's better than like a spiked ceiling coming down and killing me. note notice to all staff this document is very old much of the writing is Ill eligible why is everything like illegible like do they just like fucking with me here regular meetings of the vaccine research and infectious agents teams will be held both meetings are security level five and will be held in the following locations first floor west operations control room second floor southeast meeting room the entry code shall be 815. Thank you. Wait, what? What was eligible about that? Uh, I guess that's like, supposed to be the only thing I could read. I, I don't know. Ooh, something shiny. The crank it. No! No more cranks. I'm just kidding. I'll take it in a minute. I just want to see what else is around here before I decide to fill up my inventory space. I don't think there is anything else around here. <sighs> this crooked picture on the wall is just a painting. Okay. Imagine that. Just give me the damn crank. Thought we were done with this, Capcom. Thought we were done with cranks. Uh... Oh, God. Cranks and crows. Cranks and crows. Thought the game froze for a second. That was actually more terrifying than the crows. Uh, Rebecca? Really? Re hey! God, the AI in this game is so dumb! Rebecca! Stop! Come on. Okay. Thank you. God. I mean, we were already on team follow, so she should have been following me to begin with. How's her health? Okay. Good. As long as I haven't got to use any healing items. I don't feel like I've gotten screwed too royally. Dark ominous clouds. How about they just jump out the window? How about that? Are you guys that fucking dumb? Have you not, have you not thought about that? This isn't like the first game where uh, you know that there's rabid zombie dogs in the woods waiting for you. Just jump out of the fucking window. Just do something. Please. Is this like... Oh. This leads around. Eh It all makes sense. Yes. Sorry, that was my horrible Bane impression. Uh, you have my permission to die. I guess I have nowhere to go except for back. But I am going to go ahead and save and call it an episode for now. Uh, I think if I keep going, I'm probably going to end up recording an hour's worth of footage. I don't think anybody wants to watch a straight hour worth of footage. Or have the time to do that, so... Unfortunately, our time must come to an end at some point. So 
So I will see you guys on the next episode. Until then, take it easy. Prime out.